Oh, the toy corner. Where else would she be? Yep. Like that. Well, I guess all right. He's about as tall as you. Told you you're shrinking. Not. So what you do is you, you buy like four or five of those, take them over to your sister's place and like hide them all around the house <laughs> and freak her out. She had a better face. That's cool though. You gonna get it? Yeah. Uh, I knew she'd like that. <laughs> oh, look at the puppy Pegasus. And the wings. That is so cute. <laughs> I love it so oh much. But it just needed to be a little bit. I don't have that shadow cat. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh.
why they That's come. a lot of goosebumps. That's a lot of goosebumps. That's why they come. Hello, nerdlings. What's up, nerdlings? Tom and Lacey, Do You Nerd variety channel of all the things that we love. And something we love doing is going to conventions like the one you just saw, the Joplin Collectors Expo. Thank you so much for checking out that video, and thank you for sticking around for the pickups. Real quick, I just want to say, to this day, still, I constantly hear from people surprised that we go to so many things and have so many things in our area. I just want to encourage people, you got to make the effort to go out to this stuff. You got to find it. What is your area? For us, this one is about an hour away. Unless you're this one here, then it's like 20 minutes to drive away. Oh no, it's an hour and a half and when I drive it's an hour. <laughs> and Joplin is about an hour and a half from Tulsa as well. So you have to kind of factor in that radius. Yeah. We when usually we say make things area, about a three hour radius from yeah, us. Yeah, and that's like a three hour drive one way, spend some hours there three hour drive home. This stuff is in your area. If it's in the farming Midwest, I promise it's in your area. You gotta look and you gotta make the effort. Let's talk about pickups and I'll stop preaching to you guys. <laughs> I really didn't get a whole lot. You never do. I know. <laughs> One thing that I did get though was I won the raffle. He won a raffle. So I went with the Fantastic Four Invisible Woman. This one, though, this is pretty special because she's totally a visible woman. I can see her. So it's kind of like false advertising. <laughs> I also won oh my the raffle. And so I got me a fun Dungeons & Dragons dude. 
I wasn't collecting all of these, but now I have all but one. So I might as well get the barbarian chick, the one left. So, so you're collecting them I am. Now. I guess I am now. <laughs> In all honesty, as much as we enjoyed that movie, it was so fun. It's like, eh, why, why not? not? Why, why not, not get all, all of them? Yeah. Your other figure, though, that was a really this cool pickup. was a cool pickup. Cool find. I have always wanted the Ninja Turtles monster line. Whenever I see them, they're not really prices I'm ready to pop on and everything like that. This one was a great price. And we've never seen the um, April O'Neil Bride of Frankenstein, so I didn't even know she existed. Oh, she's creepy and she's kooky. She hangs out in the sewers where it's all ooky because there's dookie down there. Gross. So this was super cool. She is really awesome. First of all, the, the face sculpt is amazing. It looks just like the actress. Even though you've got the Bride of Frankenstein mummy wrappings, you still have her kind of like yellow iconic outfit that she wore and the purse that she had and everything but she's got this way cool like radio staff i love that detail that is so cool to see and then one of my favorite things in here is the two little mice the one with the eyeball on it one with the ear sewn on it i think those are great they're just great little touches so does that mean this is the start of collecting a whole line yes i just have to find them at a cheap enough price speaking of cheap prices i got a couple of comics they were two dollars each these are Madame Mirage from Top Cow. I have zero idea who this character is, what this comic is about, but this cover art is fantastic. Very film noir, femme fatale kind of thing. Future Tom, would you take care of this comparison? That reminds me of Lady, however you say it, Dimitrescu from Resident Evil I 8. I can see that. So maybe this was her in her previous life before, before she, she became, became a, a vampire. vampire. Picked up a fun kids meal toy. I'm not sure which one it came from, but it is one of the busts from the Haunted Mansion. And when you push his little button, he sings a little bit of the uh, song. So I was really excited to find him. I was hoping that there'd be more busts, but he was the only one I found. He's dead now. Oh. There we go. And I am also a fan of busts. <laughs> Watch! Picked up a really, really cute little rubber piranha plant keychain. I see a lot of Mario ones like this, but I've never seen a piranha plant one, so I just thought that was super cute. I picked up this really adorable little zombie keychain and his little arms and leggies moving and, and his little brain sticking out a little bit. I feel like that was the part that won you that over That was the, the part that won me over. And he kind of looked a little sad. Like, <laughs> okay. Yeah, if my brain was hanging out and like a raven was picking at it, I, I don't think I'd be too happy. Oh, that's just, I feel like that's the noise he's making. From our friends that we've seen a couple of times, of course I said, if I ever see them again, I'm always going to pick up one of these lizards and start a giant collection of them. So this is number three. Especially because they're magnetic, so we stick them on all kinds of yep. things. I cannot wait to get more, so you guys need to keep going where I'm going. And from their booth also found this really adorable uh, possum, screaming, angry possum keychain. I just, he was so adorable. I just loved him. He's like, Rawr! he's very angry. <laughs> Where we live, I mean, we see plenty of possums. I know, we have Plus, one. Plus, even us. And we have one that lives under our house. Yeah, so, so it, it's perfect. <laughs> That's basically, you know. Ah. <laughs> well, just a couple of little pickups, but... We also saw a lot of our convention friends, uh, both on the vendor side, the cosplay side, and uh, just attendee side, yep. honestly. So not both, but all. <laughs> and we did some fun little uh, video projects. By the time this video goes out, maybe those are up. I don't know. Anyway, that's a future Tom problem. Another fun convention. We always look forward to yes, Joplin Collectors Expo. Been going for a few years now. Watched it grow oh, quite yeah, a bit. We have. There's so much to see now. Like this place there's basically three rooms yeah. that you have to get through uh -huh. so you finish like one room oh you're you're not even close to being done <laughs> all right well you play with your toys i'm gonna read about madame mirage and uh not worry about bumping into the invisible woman because she's the visible woman I want my money back marvel <laughs> i didn't pay any money for that marvel you didn't you want it <laughs> <laughs> Bye, nerdlings. Bye, nerdlings. Hey, real quick, question. Let's talk about area, conventions. We do the three-hour thing. Honestly, let's hear it down below. How far would you go? What's your distance to find an area for your conventions? Bye, nerdlings. Bye. 
She's alive! Alive! You want to try that again? I don't know. It's a family show. Should I, should I cuss on him? Want me to bust your chicken McNuts? <laughs> I don't think that's any better. Chicken McNuts? <laughs> I see you. Me? I see you. I see me. Whatever. Pass by us, but I know because we're trying to shop first, uh, then talk. WTRL Cincinnati. I mean New York. Ooh. She gonna jump you? I don't know. Should I pull her hair? Don't be angry. Don't be angry. I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> so like that it one. That one's just kind of weird with the heart. <laughs> it's like, I don't know about that one. This one with the background looks cool. That one, it's like. <laughs> I mean, yeah, everybody's got to have somebody they love. So. She likes her own slapping. I don't want to wonder what her slapping is. No. <laughs> You're like, I woke up in the next county. Weird April. Do 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 Bits of pizza, bits of pizza, bits of pizza, bits of pizza. NECA creation! My wife thinks I'm hilarious!